Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new, my name is Jenna. I'm going to be sharing with you guys two hauls. First one is Walmart, second one is Sam's Club, which will be tomorrow. I fell asleep last night before I could make the Sam's Club haul, pickup, order, and um, I couldn't, there was no pickup spots today, anytime at all, to pick up my Sam's Club order. And so here we are, we're gonna pick it up tomorrow. I only have my Walmart order, which you guys are seeing here, and most of the stuff I got at Sam's Club because we do buy in bulk, we are a family of six, and I feel like we're going through groceries like crazy. So this is a big haul, budget was, 350 and I think it ended up being a little under 400 so not too bad still very expensive there was no meat products in any of this we recently just bought like 25 pounds in bulk of ground beef from family so that is what we have out there and so we don't need to buy any ground beef I'm just so sick of store-bought meat like it's just so gross it's not good anymore it's expensive and you don't know where it's coming from and so that's I like that we have bought from family and we know where it is coming from. It is delicious, so I'm so happy that we chose to do that. Chicken, however, we do still need to buy, you know, from stores and such, but I bought two big ones the last time at Sam's Club, so we're still good on chicken. There's a lot of random stuff here, and a lot of stuff, of course, is missing because it's from Sam's Club, so there's gonna be some, you know, like, oh, okay, I guess that goes with the meal from, you know, Sam's Club, but let's dive into what we have from walmart and i'll tell you the total at the end two big bags of chocolate chip morsels you guys know we do a lot of baking homemade banana bread and homemade chocolate chip cookies so that's why we have those mozzarella cheese i know it's just random one bag uh i'm getting the big five pound bag of cheese from sam's club that's why there's just this little bag because i don't need like a lot of mozzarella plus it's expensive avocados i also got avocados from sam's club too because i love avocados navy does i have an avocado a day and she has some of mine and can never have enough avocados they're so good for you two things of cinnamon rolls i like having these for the weekend so we just have one on Saturday morning and then this is like for the next week after that because the kids they just like having that and so does Zach. A pizza crust Zach likes to make a little meal out of this. It's really good. I can't remember what it's called but it's good. Danimals. I also am getting Danimals from Sam's Club but we got some of these because the kids are basically out and need more. We have 120 eggs. I know you probably think I'm crazy but we go through eggs a lot. I have eggs every morning for breakfast. I make eggs for Navy, sometimes for Savannah, and then Zach on the weekends, the baking, the meals. It's just, oops, one of my breads fell. It's just something we have to have. I like having a lot of eggs on hand, especially since we couldn't find any at one point a while ago. And I just, no, it was terrible. So I never want to be without eggs. So I get them in bulk and we eat them. Bread. Yes, I know we have a lot of bread. Uh, I have six loaves. We will freeze five and we need one. Uh, Zach has sandwiches for lunch at work when there's not leftovers. Savannah has a sandwich for lunch when I make her lunch for school and I have a sandwich every day and the Navy has either a grilled cheese or peanut butter and jelly so we've got all the sandwiches okay we will freeze it and trust me it is still good when you freeze it I promise I promise I promise just one package of margarine I still have some but you know I just like to just get one cream cheese I need this for a recipe for Navy's birthday party coming up so I had to get that five cucumbers Navy and I we love our cucumbers they are so good I got five of them and I didn't really like the cucumbers from Sam's Club so that's why I got these ones from Walmart I wasn't a fan of the Sam's Club ones I'm being honest these are Zach's he likes having these for a healthy snack he's lost over 20 pounds and so he really likes the habanero barbecue I uh, like just the plain ones not salted or anything because they're really healthy for you but they're expensive and so we just got those for him we have five two percent milks you can never have enough milk in this house and I am sick of buying one every so often buy in bulk unsweet vanilla almond milk very good have two of those two big ketchups we go through ketchup a lot in this house syrup i will also be getting syrup from sam's club however we needed it now because maverick really wants some waffles and so i had to get some we were completely out this was savannah's one request she wanted some pringles so i got her some and we're going to an event tonight and so these will be the perfect snack to bring these will these are so expensive but it's fine i mean if this is the only thing she 
specially requested it's it's okay i'm fine with it two bags of broccoli i love their broccoli it's delicious uh this is new the totina's pizza party pack i thought this would be like a fun little lunch to have on the weekends and so i got this maybe the kids will like it if not, I know Zach will like it. <laughs> Two bags of peas and carrots. This is for fried rice. Honey ham for Zach's lunches. This is what he wanted for his sandwiches. And now we're going to go everywhere. Okay, let's go here. So I've got three waterfall Method hand soaps. I love the Method hand soaps. I love their cleaners. Method is one of my favorite brands. And so that's the waterfall scent. I have three of those. Hand sanitizer. This is for my van, so I need to go put this back out in my van. I like having this on hand like my other one my other pump one finally ran out the pump one's super easy because all you have to do is just pump it and you're good to go but this is for my van and especially having a little baby and kids and going to school back and forth sickness and you know just pumping gas being in and out i want to be i'm kind of like a germaphobe when i have a baby you guys like i feel like i'm over the top but that's because i don't want them to get sick uh so i've got this alcohol this so i got this because i use this to clean like my roller like i spray it and i have like a spray bottle so i'm gonna pour this in the spray bottle helps sanitize everything so i like having this on hand and i've been out for a while finally got it very happy and I've got a big bottle of hand sanitizer. This is for my house for when people come over and then having parties and then just, this is just a lot easier to just have. And then of course, you know, I have my hand soap and washing hands. I always like having hand sanitizer too. And I didn't mean to get this big of a bottle. Uh, I think this was actually substituted, but here we are. So we're gonna have this forever and that's fine because you should have clean hands you know, before you eat <laughs> and before you hold a baby, all the things. Disinfectant spray, need this. I just uh, ran out of one. I'm gonna be cleaning my house a lot this weekend. And then of course next weekend, we're having Navy's birthday party. And I like to really clean at the weekend before the party. And then after everybody leaves, I really like to deep clean again. <laughs> so it's like a fresh, you know, I'm cleaning before people come and then I'm really cleaning after they leave. I love everybody, but I just got to clean after they leave. Laundry sanitizer. I love using this for our sheets and such, especially like if somebody is sick. And so I add this in there and then like towels as well, but definitely for sheets or, you know, kids coats and such. I need to wash their coats again this weekend because there's been a lot of sicknesses going around their schools and it's just bound to happen so I want to make sure everybody is clean and healthy you can sense a theme I am like I said a germaphobe cleaning machine when I have a baby you guys you can never be too careful that is everything I got from Walmart I believe my total was like 170 or 180 I can't I can't 100% remember which is crazy it was this expensive but you know I guess that's how much stuff is in 2024 with inflation you just have to love it like I said you just gotta love it I do want to address a question I've been asked somebody asked me if I go to Aldi and I used to go to Aldi a long time ago and I haven't just with having more kids and such just because here's my thing I'm already buying at two different stores and if I add an Aldi I'm still going to have to go to Walmart and Sam's Club and I'm gonna be honest I really like the convenience of pickup orders with having four kids especially three being young and having a baby I don't shop inside of Walmart just because I personally don't feel safe like our Walmart just is kind of eh. I just don't feel safe going into our Walmart there was like an active um, shooter situation no one was hurt or injured and they did get him out but I just personally don't feel safe going in there by myself with all of my kids and I don't really like going in there anyways but I really do like Walmart's pickup service and I like the products that they have they have a lot of things that I need and the prices so I do love the pickup order and so I just want to kind of address that that's why I do pickups a lot because it just makes my life a lot easier and I'm all about the convenience I do love going in store shopping and that's why we go to Sam's Club when we do that however we are busy this weekend and so that's why I will be doing another pickup order just because like I said it helps us with our busy lives and when you go into a store and you go with kids it's gonna take a long time which I know it's good for them to do that it's kind of like every other like we were just inside Sam's Club the last haul this time 
we're going into the store you know it's it's a good balance back and forth but that's why I don't go inside stores and I do miss Aldi it's just our Aldi is kind of like in a weird spot in town and I don't know maybe I'm making excuses probably am but I just haven't been there in a while I should probably go there sometime and like get it back in rotation but three stores is just a lot in my opinion you know I just that's a lot. I mean, sometimes I even have to go to Meyer if I don't get something from Walmart, but still, three stores is a lot to get all your groceries. I'm exhausted with just one, let alone two. Add in the third one, whew, three stores, that would be a lot. All right, we just got back from Sam's Club. This is gonna be a huge, huge order, you guys, and I ordered Navy's birthday cake. Finally, I got that going. Uh, they didn't have the theme I wanted, so I had to like custom design it and all that. You guys will see that in an upcoming video. Hasn't happened yet, uh, but here it is, and I'm gonna dive into what I got at Sam's Club. All right, we have a lot to unpack. Here we have four pounds of Honeycrisp apples. Gotta love the apples there. I highly recommend. Uh, avocados, I know I got avocados at Walmart, uh, but I also got them at Sam's Club. We love avocados, I have an avocado a day. Two bunches of bananas, I wish they were a little bit yet more yellow, but that's okay, it's fine, we can work with that. Two pounds of strawberries, love their strawberries, they're so good. Pre-sun, I have this for Navy's party, and then I also like having this for spring, summertime coming up, so then, you know, the kids have something different. The kids always drink water and then occasionally milk, uh, so this is kind of like a little treat uh, then we have a big five quart of cookies and cream ice cream this is for us and then also for Navy's birthday party if somebody wants you know ice cream with the cake this is the only ice cream I got I'm not gonna load up on like different flavors so this is what I have diet Pepsi for Zach he that's what he likes to drink we've got Danimals 18 strawberry banana 18 strawberry flavor uh, dishwasher pods we were almost completely out of those waffle gotta have the waffles now I have a big bag of baking soda uh, how big is this I think this is like five pounds or something I'll put it down below but I like buying my baking soda in bulk I use it to clean and then I also use it for baking and such maple syrup I don't know why I just called it maple syrup but we have syrup so there we go and Zach needed some more vitamins we've got water bottles for the birthday party next weekend and then Zach can also use them for work 10 pound bag of potatoes. We love having potatoes, either fried potatoes or we make french fries out of them homemade or mashed potatoes. Gotta have potatoes on ham. Tortillas, these are our favorite. I have more of those. Big five pound bag of, I call this Colby Jack cheese. Colby Jack cheese, delicious. I like buying it in bulk. More chicken nuggets for my kids. Gotta have them. Chicken bites, this is for Zach. He loves these. I mean, they're okay. Navy likes these too, but that's just my opinion. They like them though. Zach wanted a big bag of berries, frozen berries. This is for his smoothies that he's been having. This is a four pound bag. This is a really good deal. I think this was maybe like 10 or $11. Cheez-Its, the kids love Cheez-Its, especially Navy. And then I pack these for like a little side snack for Savannah and her lunches. These are for me. I love these coconut rollers. They are absolutely delicious. Highly recommend. They are expensive, but I promise you, they are worth it. Lucky Charms. Yes, my kids love Lucky Charms. Hate me. That's just how it is. Lace Chips. We got one bag of those. Zach's Pickles. He loves these little dill pickles. Grape Jelly. Gotta have some grape jelly with the peanut butter and jellies I have every day. String Cheese. These are perfect for Zach's lunches and Savannah's lunches, and I like it for just like a little snack to tide me over. Uh, corn Chips. So we can have nachos, and what I mean by nachos is like we cook hamburger meat like tacos, and then we put them on chips and then you know that's nachos so delicious I may or may not be having that tomorrow or tonight for dinner don't know oh I got two bags of lace chips okay because you have to buy two that's why you know that's why that's like that lastly I have these two things I actually went in store to when I ordered the cake and I like had gotten this and the jelly this is for Navy for her birthday and I got the size up so then you know it lasts a while because I, I do find members mark pajamas for kids run a little small so definitely you know if you want them to last longer size up got the these for Xavier this is a four pack and it's so cute we've got blue striped trucks and buses I think 
And there's four of these. It's such a good deal. I got the size six months because he's becoming such a biggie boy. And so I thought I might as well just go up a size and have those there. That is everything that I got from Sam's Club. And I can't remember exactly what my total was. Um, I think all together maybe. Well, the pickup order was like $2.50 maybe. And then the stuff I got inside the store is maybe like $30. Uh, I'll put the total down below for you guys. But that is everything I got from both Walmart and Sam's Club. This is our big haul that we do we do not do another big haul like this throughout the month we do one big haul and then smaller hauls so we should be good for a while we shouldn't need groceries for two weeks the only thing we might need is strawberries bananas and avocados that's it we shouldn't need anything else for two weeks which i think that's pretty normal people usually need like fruits and vegetables and stuff like that you know like midway through so we're gonna kind of test and see how long it lasts fingers crossed it lasts a good while but i really hope that you guys enjoyed this video if you did please be sure to give it a huge thumbs up subscribe if you guys would like to see more and i will see you guys in my next video